We're excited about this. We think it's a viable option. Amid cheers, plans to make Saddleback a community-owned resort were announced today. Last Friday, the Berries agreed to the terms by which the newly formed Saddleback Mountain Community Resort, LLC, can acquire the ski area. To make it happen, the group needs to raise $4 million to sign the deal, a new fundraising goal skiers seemed optimistic about. I don't think it'll be tough at all. I think there are a lot of deep pockets. There are generations of people who have been coming to range in the area for hunting and fishing. The area was sparse last year. The resort didn't open and millions in revenue was lost in the Rangeley area. With no snow, uh, lack of snowmobilers and certainly Saddleback being closed, Main Street was dead. Um, the retail shops were struggling, restaurants struggled, we all struggled. I actually worked at a different ski resort and made a third of what I made working at Saddleback. If the group is able to raise the $4 million quickly, staff could be back at the resort this winter, but organizers are cautious. It depends on how fast the money comes in. It depends on what makes sense as we start, you know, working to open the ski area. And, and truthfully, it depends on uh, what nature does for us in terms of natural snowfall. The fundraising campaign starts this week. One perk, donors giving $2,000 or more get memberships, a bonus to kickstart the effort to save Saddleback Mountain. They're invested in that area, and I have no doubt they'll raise it. I don't think it'll be tough at all. Now, once that initial purchase is made, they'll need to make another $25 million to get repairs up and running here at the resort, get those repairs done. And there is a separate deal, a plan to purchase the land here for, there's about 3,000 acres of forest land that's going to be purchased and that's going to preserve the land around the ski slope. So uh, we look forward to having that fundraising effort get kicked, kicked off. It's on the website, ski, uh, skisaddlebackme.com. Fundraising starts tomorrow. Live in Rangeley, Kyle Jones, WMTW News 8.